Hello, we are at Zinc in Novi Sad and uh, we are here standing with Sarayu. He just gave uh, an excellent talk and we are really happy to have him here. Hello Sarayu. Hi, Godana, thank you for inviting me. It's really excellent experience to be part of uh, Zinc 2018. So I have one question. How do you like the energy of Zinc? Excellent. People are really enthusiastic okay, and there is a lot of communication among the attendees who have uh, uh, come to see a lot of technical presentation, poster presentation and uh, demo. So I think it is a very good combination of a variety of things starting from electronics and there are some medical things we talked in the morning uh, from uh, medical side which is a very good mix that gives us some motivation what more can be done in electronics. So next year are we going to see you again? Uh, there is possibility because I keep going in various parts and this is a good timing. Uh, because we have summer uh, that ends in May, so there is a high probability. Okay, okay perfect. Because uh, we really like to see people back. Sure, very good. And nice. especially people that uh, are our friends, so... Okay, sure, thank you. Tell me, Navi Sad, have you had a chance to see? Uh, I saw Belgrade, actually, half a day I <laughs> toured Belgrade, then uh, Novi Sad I have seen the riverside. Okay, mm -hmm. that is the most beautiful, that's what I read from uh, TripAdvisor somewhere, uh, so I, I took a walk there, so, but I think uh, city center or some, some place that I have to go. Uh, in conferences, mm -hmm. C Magazine is really, really popular, and in particular in the last few years, the rewards uh, are just keep coming, and the quality uh, all is maintained always, and uh, so we are actually collaborating. Mm -hmm. uh, we collaborate for Berlin conference, for this sure, conference. Sure, right. And uh, so do you have any advice for the authors, uh, like on the topics or what are you looking for uh, when they submit an article for the magazine? Okay, yeah, that's a very good question. So actually, uh, that, is, that is a question that uh, has been discussed in IEEE many times. That is, uh, if you have a conference paper, how do you make a periodical article, mm -hmm. like in journal, magazine, or letter? Mm -hmm. Okay. So IEEE policy is uh, you have to have uh, a significantly uh, new material. Mm -hmm. Okay. And that has been left to the EIC is what is that significant percentage? Okay. So for me, I have set 40 percent new material. Okay. And uh, some transactions, they say 70%, okay, B but uh, I have seen minimal is 30%, 30 to 70 anywhere, people are doing. So my expectation is 40% new material, and I tell authors that uh, make sure, uh, and, uh, sorry, keep in mind that uh, uh, your conference article as well as periodical article, they will go to IEEE Explorer, and at the end, if you have similar material, then two PDF files are same. So it's a good idea to rewrite as much as possible, redraw the figures, and add uh, some more figures and, and more tables. So then you, you are uh, in a safe zone and you're getting a paper when both go to IEEE Explorer, there are no issues. That's why we have an uh, extended abstract. If they write an extended abstract, so mm -hmm. read like that, then there then is a lot much of, simpler. Yes, much simpler. Lots right. of ways to right. actually ah, extend right. that. Um, lately, uh, people are asking a lot about open access because uh, mm -hmm. The projects that are funded by European Union, they are required to uh, publish uh, openly. Right. So, what is the policy of C Magazine on that? Uh, actually, again, that is also a IEEE discussion. How mm -hmm. they will implement something that is, uh, uh, what you can say, acceptable in European community as well as US. So, uh, so far, what IEEE has been doing, open access has a charge. That, that is, there is a fee, around $1,750 that author pays to make it open access. So uh, then uh, when a lot of people want open access, how that will be handled is a, is a matter of discussion. That's what I'm seeing in IEEE panel of editors and so on. Uh, that uh, a recent panel of editors I had attended in April. Okay, so these are matter of discussion. How IEEE will implement open access uh, that is applicable in global context. Okay, well, is there anything that you would like to add for the end of this conversation? Uh, I think Zinc has been doing very well, there is uh, so good growth and uh, uh, probably the, the way I heard I, Zinc is owned by IEEE Serbia and Montenegro section, mm -hmm. then maybe you can call it IEEE Zinc, that uh, uh, because uh, right now in um, 
thousands of conferences are there in around the planet and uh, uh, there is a difference between technical co-sponsorship and um, IEEE owned conference. So IEEE conference, owned conference has IEEE in the title. Okay, and the way I hear that uh, Zinc is owned by IEEE Sorbia and Montenegro section and it is technically co-sponsored by C Society. Okay, so because of Sorbia and Montenegro ownership, you can use uh, IEEE uh, in the title. That, that probably will have more credibility because IEEE has its own brand name. Yeah, yeah, that's correct. And uh, well, we actually put when we submit the papers. Mm -hmm. um, this was uh, because it's short. It was for the marketing purposes. Sure. That's why the website is like Go Zinc. Okay. Uh, like Go right. to Zinc. <laughs> yeah. Right. Okay. Very good. Okay. Right. Thank you. Thank you so much. Sure. Okay. See you next year. Okay.